Good day YouTube. This is just a very quick first look at the latest release of Linux Mint 19.2, uh, codenamed Tina. Now I'll be doing a quite a lot more of these videos shortly if you know my channel, but uh, this is just a really quick uh, look and feel to see what's going on here. Now uh, this is, uh, I'm actually having some resolution issues at the moment, but I'm sure I'll be able to fix those shortly. But it is running on the virtual box at the moment. Just just from the outset though, you can see there is some slight differences here. It seems like the uh, the actual Cinnamon, now this is the Cinnamon desktop release, so it is the actual, um, you could call it the default version of, uh, of a Linux Mint. It's, it does seem to be a little bit smaller, a little bit different, a little bit, uh, yeah, more of a refined desktop environment, which is pretty cool to see there. But uh, we'll be checking a lot more things shortly, but appreciate your time, guys. Super quick video, like I said, and I'm um, looking to get into, uh, yeah, seeing what this is all about. Although, just to prove that it is, because uh, in my previous videos, I've sort of done a bit of a hack job. Let's uh, see if we can run NeoFetch for a second, and <coughs> just confirm what exactly we're dealing with. So that'll be pretty cool to see. So that's loading up. We'll get a few basic specs about the machine, which I'll cover in later videos there. But we have, okay, so that's pretty standard looking to me. The kernel doesn't upgrade as fast as Ubuntu. Uh, we got an, yeah, four, Cinnamon 4.2.2. That's, that's to be expected, a little bit newer there. Uh, a few little bits and pieces here and there. But here's the main thing here. Here's the real shiner. That's what's going on there. So cheers, guys. Uh, super quick video. Hope you've enjoyed.